In this video, we will use Jira Automation to add the current date to the description when a new Jira card is created. First, navigate to Jira Automation. Depending on your Jira, the Automation section may be located in a different spot on your page. So in this case, the Automation section is located under my Project Settings tab and then Automation on the left-hand side. In this example, Project Settings is located on the left-hand column and then automation is located on the left-hand side. Once, you, once you're on your automation page, click Create a New Rule. The first thing that we're going to do is select a trigger. So our trigger is going to be when the issue is created. So I, I have issue created right here, or I can um, start typing in here and it will filter out, um, filter to the trigger that I want. So we're going to use issue created. And then the next thing is um, once we save, we're going to go over to the left hand side and click add component. And what we want to do is create a variable. Um, so we're going to click on new action and then in the search we're going to go create variable and we'll select create variable and for variable name we'll call it current date and for smart value the smart value for adding um, a date there's actually quite a few different ones and the one that i'm going to use is the short date. So that's gonna give us, uh, for example, today is January 2nd, 2023. So it's gonna give us the date in short format one slash two slash 23. And as you can see the smart value, it gives you the format that you should type the value in. So the first thing is uh, following that example, we're gonna type it in just like this. Now the short, date and it gives us the prompt there too because I've used this before. So now we have our smart value in there and we click save. And then we're going to add another component, another new action. And this one is going to be edit issue. Choose fields to um, set. So in this case, our field should be our uh, description. So we're gonna check that. And checking that will open our description box here. Um, and so in this case, um, we just enter in our, uh, our variable, which as again is current date. So the format for that current date. So if this is all that we add, um, then we'll have our current date added in here. Um, and that anytime you create a new issue, it'll populate it with the current date. So let's save. We're going to name this add current date to description when new issue created. All right, now let's turn it on. And then let's uh, let's go test this out. So I'm going to hop over to my board and then I'm going to go down here and create a new issue. Um, let's call it test. And now here's our new issue. So I'm going to open that. And you can see in the description, here is today's date. So if you want to add like, um, some text so as as to indicate like well what what is this date when you're looking at it what you can do for that we hop back over to automation and we edit this automation it'll go to this section here you can just type in text here and whatever text you type in it will appear um, as that text so what we can do is um, this issue was created on and then once you click saved 
you go up here and click publish rule. Now let's go back to our board and create a new issue. We'll call it test four. Open that up. And now we have the description saying this issue was created on 1, 2, 23. And that will be the case anytime that we create a new issue with this rule running. All right, everyone, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care and have a happy new year 2023. Bye.